tell me that you would be mine I can't believe my eyes tonight Good morning everybody, what's up, how's it going? Welcome back to another daily vlog. It is Friday today, but for you guys, you're watching this next day. So it is Saturday for you. I hope you're all having an awesome weekend so far. And I hope that you're doing the most of it. I hope you're making the most of it, being active, getting out of your friends, getting out of your family, making awesome memories, because it is lovely weather. I'm not sure if it's lovely weather everywhere in the world, but for those of you who live in the UK, London, around this area, it is beautiful weather, guys. So get out and make the most of it. Go and do awesome things this weekend, guys. I've got an awesome video planned in today's vlog, guys. This video is going to be awesome. Awesome. So this morning, I obviously just walked Maverick as you just saw. It's currently 12 o'clock. I had a bit of a late start today because I was doing some freelance work again. As it, for those who watched yesterday's video, you know that how I get paid and make my money on YouTube is I do like works for companies. Companies send me edits to do. I do an edit, give it to them, and they pay me for it, guys, because my editing skills have developed much more now because of YouTube, which is just so amazing. So YouTube and you guys have helped me through that, and I can't thank you guys enough. But as I was just saying, I started a late one because I usually start the video about 7 o'clock every single morning. But I started late today because I was busy this morning. But anyway, it's still going to be an awesome vlog. What I want to do today, you guys never knew where I lived before when I lived in this house. Before we lived in this house, you guys never saw where we lived. And where we used to live, guys, it used to just be so amazing. It was like a, a private estate, guys. It was really lovely. And I just thought today would be a good vlog to go back and try bring back some childhood memories because I want to experience it, guys. I thought it would be pretty fun just to go there myself. I'm not sure if I'm going to get in because, as I said, it's private. So get in, I'm probably going to have to jump a gate to get over guys because there's cameras and that no one could tell me that you would be mine I can't believe my so guys I'm currently on the way to obviously where I used to live which I spoke about earlier and it's good because this place is literally only 10 minutes away from where I live now it's literally just down the road but obviously because I'm skateboarding there it's about 10 minutes I can't literally believe how hot it is today guys it is 27 degrees getting like England what is going on the last couple of days you've been hotter hotter than it is in like Cyprus and America and like it is in different countries it's just pretty crazy guys I'm enjoying this weather though you need to make the most of it while it lasts because it's probably not going to be like this for any longer but I'm going away anyway so I don't mind so I'm, I'm, I'm here and it's hot and going away and it's going to be hot still don't know how I'm going to get in because I've got a jump a gate I think to get in because as I said it's private guys I've literally just got here and as you can see the gate's behind me so what I've got to do is jump over this gate it's got barbed wiring as well guys it's going to be hard to get over this I don't usually climb fences and I'm in skinny jeans as well so it's going to be hard but I think we can do it but we've got to do it without anybody seeing us as well there's a camera guys right there look literally right there as you can see just let me be the one to hold you tight show you guys we got over the gate I know this is kind of breaking and I'm not telling you guys in your free time to go and climb gates but I really needed to get in here and see it again this camera's looking at me anyway but I used I lived here for 14 years guys and I just wanted to come back here I know I know I shouldn't be climbing over gates but I'm in now <laughs> let's go that was harder climb than I thought guys because there's so much bar Ryan I, I did cut my jeans but oh well they're ripped jeans anyway look <laughs> got a tiny cut there this is just such a nice place like we lived here for 14 years guys and under not in this house i'll show you the house to use a lip here but like this is the, gr the green area i'll take my drone up guys in a minute and get some aerial shots i'll take my drone up. guys some of these houses behind me as you can see their apartments some of them are not far off a million pound guys some of them are like 600 000, 700 000. we didn't live there i'll show you where we lived in a minute as i just said look at this place like that is pretty crazy guys like look how big it is let's take the drone up and get some aerial shots you feel so weird being back here like i haven't been back here in now four years it's been four years since yeah it's been four years guys everything looks identically the same it hasn't changed one single bit guys i used to live right here look st martin's lane down there feel, everything feels so familiar like because i lived here as i said for 14 years I haven't been back in four years and there's literally like no one around like when i used to live here there used to be kids everywhere like we used to be playing football here every single day it's so weird but this is what i want to show you guys right behind me is the mansion the whole thing is worth four million pounds it's a whole mansion guys like look at the size of it four million pounds 
for that like that is just absolutely crazy and someone lives in it someone still lives in there guys it's just pretty amazing as you saw in the drone shots as well like that from the air looked so big i, I, I thought it had a swimming pool but it was a pond because i haven't been back in so long i live down there guys <laughs> My childhood memories here like literally like before i started vlogging everything was here guys i lived here as i told you 14 years you just all my childhood memories here like when i used to play football down there like we walked down there now i used to play football down there over there with everyone like all my mates and then we've got like the little children's playground as, as we're going to now guys everything just feels so weird no one could tell me that you would be mine can it really be this quiet? Like I thought there'd be a couple of dog walkers. It's just empty, guys, and it never used to be like this. I don't know what has happened. I don't know if no kids live here anymore. Them memories on the monkey bars do not. They're called monkey bars. These things, guys. The monkey play area. This does not bring back good memories because I broke my arm three times in here. I broke my wrist once, my elbow once, and my other elbow lit literally right on this one, guys. When I was about eight. So many of you guys keep on asking me, Nick. You told us how you make your money, but how did you get into the freelance work? And I, I do remember I didn't mention actually explain how, how to do it, guys. So when I get home later, I explain basically how you can get into it and how i got into it guys so yeah let's head home now oh guys i need an ice pole because in here somewhere i need one of these guys it's friday diet program ice cream's not going to affect my diet program i needed one bad you guys it is just too hot outside i needed that Sweet guys, so I've literally just got home now, back from where I used to live. Basically, this part of the vlog I was explained earlier was just about bringing you guys along. Like, kind of like a day out, really, guys, just to going back to where I used to live, bringing back some childhood memories. Also, you guys are probably wondering what happened to my bed, because my bed used to be where you are now. Got taken down, guys, because it's really hard to explain without giving it away. We are going somewhere in two months' time that involves taking everything from here to this place. And for those of you who go, for those guys who are clever enough to know what we're doing, then you can figure it out. So it's all been packed up, ready to go, guys. So as you guys know, I think it was two days ago, I made the video about how I make my money. And, and you guys know that I now do freelancing for different companies. So companies, I do YouTube full-time, but I also, at home some days, guys, Companies send me edits to do. I do an edit for them at home and send it back to them and they pay me for it guys And you lot have all been asking me Nick, how did you get in doing that? I really want to do that I just re I'm really interested in it because I love editing and guys It's not something so simple where you can just go I'm gonna do that and make money guys the reason how I got it and I'm gonna literally be completely honest with you guys I got it by doing I sent my YouTube channel links to the companies that I wanted to do it for and as I told you I've been I've been doing edits for lad Bible films for life I'll be wondering as well so how did you get doing that and as i told you i sent my youtube link to them went in and had a meeting with them showed them what i could do they gave me an edit and said let's see done it give it to them then they wanted me and then and then they asked me to do another job guys and they pay me money for it and all the companies i've done it for have absolutely loved me so it's not something so really easy you can do it if you're not good at it guys then you're not going to get paid i'm not saying i'm a master at editing because i'm still learning and developing every single day basically how i did it i sent my youtube channel links told them i was really passionate and interested because i have quite a good following on my YouTube. They knew that I would be interested into, in, into doing editing and vlogging and creating content. To wrap that all up, guys, so how I got into the freelancing thing, and you literally just gotta be yourself, guys, and go for it. If you really love editing and you really love being involved in creating content, then just go for it. Stop waiting, guys. Give it a shot, give it a go. It doesn't matter if you fail. Failure is good, guys. You forget the failure and learn the lesson. And that's what I tell you guys every single day. Just be yourself and go for different things. Get outside your comfort zone. I'm not just talking about, as I said, freelancing. If you're scared, too scared to try new things, Things, guys just go for it give it a go it doesn't matter if you're not good at it because i was never good at vlogging guys when i first started but i've developed over the year i've been doing it and i'm still developing every single day and i'll forever will be Come on, guys quickly before i finish today's video here because it's coming to an end is currently let's just check the time right now it's 10 past 9 guys and i've got so much editing to do tonight and i've also got to have a bath i just left my bath running time has flown today time has absolutely flown today but it's been an awesome day it's good to go back and show you guys where i used to live but quickly before we end the video as you guys know we do every single friday we do the bsf army the best bsf army member of the week if you want to be a winner of the best bsf army member of the week guys all you got to do is literally just do what you do every single day comment and say that you're a true bsf army member and i'll be picking different people every single week to shout out you can't win the same one twice so guys this week's winner person called lily greenway lily greenway guys such an awesome vlog and it really made me have a good night from a crappy day and hearing that guy just means a lot and she and it's not just from that single comment guys she always comments on the videos i know like most people who comment now and it's the same people every single day it's just pretty awesome guys thank you so much lily for that it was an amazing comment guys this is who's person guys go and hit her up lily greenway guys i could pick any single one of you every single week i could pick all of you guys but it's just not 
not enough to, to I can't do it in a video guys because I know all of your comments are amazing but it's just certain people guys doing it every single day just means the world to me as I say if you didn't win this time you have a chance to win next time guys just make sure guys you turn my notifications off subscribe to my channel and comment down below that you're a true BSL farming member and I'll be picking the best BSL farming member every single Friday guys I hope you have enjoyed today's video I'm gonna finish it here don't forget to be yourself guys because you're all beautiful you're all amazing I love each and every single one of you just the way you are you're one of a kind guys be you I see you tomorrow with another daily vlog just keep smiling guys just keep being positive and keep being yourself because everybody else is taken <laughs> <laughs>